Good evening. We're glad you're with us tonight. And we start here at 6 with new developments in a News 9 investigation. It centers on a possible ethics investigation at the state capitol. Stacey Cameron is the first to break the story. And Stacey, your investigation certainly has people talking. And it has plenty of people talking about this story. And while it is a complicated issue, it all boils down to whether someone with ties to House Republican leadership violated ethic rules and possibly Oklahoma law by wrongfully diverting campaign funds. The money in question was raised in October 2004. State records show 11 Republican House candidates gave more than $33,000 to the state party. But those checks were never handed over to the state Republican Party. Instead, the checks were deposited into the coffers of the Oklahoma County Republican Committee. Sources tell me from there, the money was used to pay campaign bills for various House Republican candidates. At the time, Lance Cargill, our current Speaker of the House, was in charge of raising money for House Republicans. Today, I spoke with Gary Jones, Chairman of the State Republican Party, who understands that an ethics investigation is underway. The only thing I can see is that they want to have more control over the direction of the funds, and, and otherwise I don't know. Now, Jones says he has no idea who allegedly diverted the funds in question, and it would not have benefited the state party, he says, but in fact hurt Republicans statewide. Now, late this afternoon, Speaker Cargill issued this statement, which reads in part, We are not aware of any ethics violations that have occurred, but to be absolutely clear, I did not solicit, receive, deposit, or ex any victory fund checks. Amy? All right, Stacey, and tonight at 10, we have the response of some current and former lawmakers who campaigns made the contributions in question.